Hey, what's going on? Randy here, uh, owner at Oceanside Fit Body Bootcamp, and I am going to run through absolutely everything you need to know about your uh, program, your experience here at Oceanside Fit Body. So let's dive right into it. First thing is, uh, my mug is covering up some of these quotes, but let's go through them anyway. I want you to know kind of how our philosophies are here at Fit Body, so you know what we're all about. First thing is, it's about progress, not perfection. Let's be real, nobody's perfect, but what we are all striving for is progress. We don't want to just stay the same and be stagnant. Let's make progress over time, okay? And attitude is everything, because realistically, you get to choose your attitude, and your attitude determines whether you're having a good time or a bad time. So if you're happy, it's because you have a great attitude. If you're not so happy, you're choosing to let things bog you down and get in the way of you having a good attitude. So remember, your attitude is everything. That shapes your whole entire life experience. All right, moving on. Who are we? Well, on the left, you'll notice the little lifting guy. Well, we are definitely all about fitness and a healthy lifestyle. The next one is signaling that I'm a bit of a fitness nerd. Uh, I totally geek out on this stuff. And in fact, my bachelor's degree is in exercise science with a whole bunch of other things added onto that. But I want you to know you're in good hands. We really get uh, down into the science of this stuff and, and know what we're talking about. In addition to that, we also have a whole lot of love and care. Uh, you'll find that Shelly, Javier, the whole team, we all really care about you and your results. So we want you to make progress. And when you add it all together, this is what you get. The result on the right is a, a picture of our Fit Fam. You can tell we're all having, all having a great time. You can tell that we like to smile while we're going through the process and just knock it out and have fun while we're at it. So that's a little bit about uh, who we are, but who we aren't. It's important that you realize we're not coming into a bodybuilder style gym. Um, we're not bodybuilders. We're not like taking this so seriously that we forget to have fun in the process. Um, it's also important that you don't go beyond the point of like where it consumes your whole life, right? No, we're not about that. We want balance in your life. So we're not going to the extent of uh, this fellow here. But uh, nothing wrong with that, but that's just not our style, okay? And here we are. This is our team. In the middle, you'll see Shelly and I, uh, the owners. And then, of course, on the sides, we've got our coaches, Coach Mike and Coach Javier. Uh, Coach Mike on the left is being accompanied by his wonderful wife, Wendy. She actually found us first and loved us so much, said, Mike, you got to check this place out. He worked out with us for a while and jumped on board. He's uh uh, great coach as well as Javier. These guys are outstanding. You're going to love them. So can't wait for you guys to meet them. All right. Our fit family core values. What basically drives our business are these principles right here. We value community. It's important that you like where you're going and the people around you. We also, of course, value positivity. That's what makes our community so great. And of course, encouragement. Everyone's here not only to better themselves, but we want to encourage each other to do well at the same time. So it's more than just uh, yourself. Also, progress. Again, like I said before, it's about progress, not perfection. You're not just staying the same. We're always getting better. And lastly is gratitude. No better way to live than with an attitude of gratitude. You fill your heart with gratitude and you will be living a fulfilled life. So our mission and our vision Mission here at Oceanside Fit Body is to establish a culture based around our core values, which provides an environment that is second to none in order to revolutionize the way fitness is done and deliver outstanding results. So you'll probably notice that we're a little bit different than your standard gym. We're going to care when you're missing. We're going to want to help you to get great results. Whereas oftentimes you go to a gym and then they just say, there's the equipment. Good luck. Have fun. So, uh, yeah, our experience here, pretty well shaped up by uh, our mission. All right, so our vision, we really hope to have a huge impact in our community, and that means transforming 10,000 lives. Not necessarily all at our location, but through you, we can reach other people. We want to do this with mindset, education, or, sorry, mindset, nutrition, and exercise. Okay, those are the three big areas where we can really change someone's life. We're going to do that with you. We're going to do that with 
through you to uh, your community, your friends, your family as well. So the goal is it in 10,000 people. So how does the program work? Well, there's one trial opportunity. Each person gets a trial to test it out and see how you like it. And that's what you're doing. After that, then you get to go on to a membership, which we can talk about later in person. But in the membership, that's where, or in the trial, we're going to set goals with you and we're going to track your progress. We're going to make sure that you're getting closer to your goals rather than just going aimlessly through the journey and seeing where you end up. All right. We also want to focus on your habits. We want to take old bad habits that don't serve you so well and we want to replace them with good new habits. Muscle soreness. You're going to experience a little muscle soreness. The goal though is to make it not consume your life. We want it to be so that you don't fear sitting down or walking down the stairs. We want it to be that you know you did something, you got some work done, but something that's not outrageous. Okay, so let's we'll work with you closely on that. I'll talk more about it in a little bit. All right, we also want to find enjoyment in the process. If you just despise the whole thing because you hate exercise and the thought of eating healthy, well, it's going to be a little bit tougher. But on the contrary, if you find some enjoyment and you enjoy something about the whole process, like making it a game or challenging yourself to do more than you did before or hitting milestones, well, in that case, then you're going to enjoy the process and you're going to find it easier to stick to when things get tough. So another way to do that is celebrating along the way. We celebrate wins. We celebrate milestones. In fact, on the left, you'll see the stars that people are holding. Those go on our wall of fame. And those are for when you hit 100 workouts, 200, 300, 400 workouts. We value uh, your positive behavior of following through and executing on doing your workouts. So, of course, we want to reward you for those. So we'll dish out little prizes along the way. So what else? Well, uh, Zen Planner is our mobile app, which is free. It goes on your phone. It tells you the schedule, um, live schedule. If we ever cancel a class or, yeah, I mean, never happens, but for like a holiday or something, you'll notice that it's reflected there. Also, you can reserve your spot in sessions as well. There's an iPad up front at the front desk. When you come in, you're just going to go straight to the iPad, start punching in your name, and then just check in on the iPad every time. That's how we track your attendance. And then, of course... There is the Oceanside FBBC family. That's our private Facebook group. So on that group, that's or in that group is where we get most of our communication with our members because it's just a very quick, easy way to communicate. Um, we'll reach out to you guys for insight, and uh, I won't talk about it too much more, but I definitely highly suggest you get in that Facebook group. So search for that if you haven't already. And then, of course, checking in on Instagram and Facebook. Check in. You're going to make a difference with the people around you. You might inspire somebody else to take action and join here or somewhere somewhere else and take uh, charge of their own health and fitness. All right. Also, I want to point out that there is a bit of a difference between weight loss and fat loss. Some people, you're going to lose weight. That's That's how it is. That's good. That's what we want, right? But for others, it's not always going to happen. If you're already at a reasonable weight or weight that's close to the healthy recommended range, but you know you've got a little extra body fat, well, you might just find that your body fat decreases while your muscle mass increases. And when you average it out, your weight could still stay, stay the same. So you could be shrinking and still Dropping body fat, but weight staying the same. Here's a great example of that right here on the left. You'll see this is actually two pictures of the same girl. She doesn't look the same, but it's the same girl, and she weighs the exact same amount. The difference here is on the right, she's got more muscle. And on the left, it's more body fat. So what we're going to do is work the fat loss strategy. Because when you're increasing muscle, you're speeding up your metabolism, making it so that you keep the fat off for good. So let's not get too hung up on the scale, all right? Body fat percentage, the way your clothes fit, measurements, those things, those things go a long ways. All right. Oop. We've also got uh, this question here, was, which is, will this work for me? And everyone, that's a fair question. I mean, you want to know, is this going to happen? Well, as long as you follow through, most definitely it will. We've got the information for you. You've got the education. We train you. We teach you. 
Now, here are just some examples just to show you the proof is in the pudding. It does work. We've got a few right here. I'm not going to hammer too many of the details, but down 15 plus 11% body fat. That's great. And then down 50 on the right. Amazing. These two women are still with us and they're actually past those numbers by now. Uh, over here, we're going to find that you're going to see people from all different walks of life. You're going to have men, women, younger, older, different ethnicities, different ages, different shapes and sizes. So it works for anyone really. Go to the next slide, same uh, examples. We've also got couples working out with us, tons of couples. It's a great thing to do with your significant other or your spouse. And carrying on, I won't spend a whole lot of time, but as you can see, just a number of different examples of the wonderful progress that people have made. We've got mother-daughter combos, guys, gals, and everything in between. So there we are. Actually, as I'm looking at these, I'm seeing that some of these are outdated. Uh, a lot of these people are down much more than this by now. Uh, these are older pictures of uh, our current members that have uh, actually surpassed these numbers. All right, so carrying on. I will show you NSVs. NSV stands for non-scale victories. There are things to celebrate other than just the weight being down or the body fat percentage being down. You want to celebrate all the, the fun things we're celebrating, like I could do three pull-ups now when I could do none, or my cholesterol's down, I'm off my medications, I have way more energy than I had before. These are all wonderful things, wonderful benefits of our program. So don't forget to focus on those things as well because that adds to your quality of life. All right, so nutrition. Nutrition is a key component to your success. We're not going to mess around with it with pretending that it's not, okay? And it's also not a one-size-fits-all. No cookie-cutter programs. Nutrition is a very personal thing. So what you want to do is meet with us. We go through nutrition with you on a one-on-one -on -one basis. Um, we do have meal plans to follow as well, but we do want to make sure that we're meeting you where you're at. Rather than flipping your whole world on its head, we want to find what's the right move for you. Because it's more than just physiological, it's also psychological. So we need to be very smart about the approach that we take, and that's what we're here for. We also, uh, in that smart approach, we focus on habits. So if you are familiar with the psychology of habit change, you realize that if you have a habit, it's always there. It's a feedback loop. You have a trigger, a behavior, and a reward every time, and it never goes away. But what you can do is take the bad habits and just simply replace them with good habits. Exercise is a fantastic habit because it gives you that same reward. It gives you a magnificent reward for obviously physically, but also mentally and emotionally as well. So I strongly encourage you to take whatever bad habits are in your face right now, let's replace them with good habits, such as nutrition. We're gonna do this one, or sorry, such as exercise. We're going to do this one thing at a time. Exercise is a great place to start. We can always go on to nutrition shortly after, once you got that exercise component down pat. So here's a wonderful quote from my man, Brian Tracy. I'm not going to go through it, but I do want you to take a moment, pause, read it, and really think about this one. Now the workouts. So the way it starts is we all circle up at the designated time for the workout and we start on the dot we're going to go through a warm-up where we all do the same exercises uh, together and during that we go through a demonstration this is what you're going to do for today here's how the exercises uh, work here's how the format is and so during that it's going to be important that you're there on time so you don't miss the workout uh, demonstration because it's different every day also please be conscious of not only gathering the information for yourself but not distracting anyone else from getting the information and the demonstration. So, uh, timeliness and chatter. No chatter. All right, injuries. It is very important that you do spend time making sure that we are aware of your injuries. If you have any, uh, we don't want to work through them. We want to work around them. So please tell us beforehand so we can adjust accordingly. I want you to think of this like personal training, not like, oh, it's just a group class that you're going to join and do some workouts. No. We really dive in to make it work well for you, okay? Um, with that said, we don't need to go 100% right off the bat, especially if you're just getting into your exercise routine. 
So we really suggest 50%. And I'm going to use this analogy, tanning, because it's a really great analogy. When, like, let's just say you're a pasty white guy like me uh, going to hop into a tanning bed. You wouldn't pick the most, the strongest tanning bed and go for the longest duration, right? You'd get sunburned and then wouldn't be able to go back in the tanning bed for a long time rather than getting tanner faster, right? So that's exactly how this works. Rather than diving into two workouts a day and going as hard as you can, getting results faster, no, it doesn't work that way. You will upset your muscles in not such a great way. So we need to ease into it. 50% effort is perfectly fine, and let's build it up little by little over the first couple of weeks. Then we'll get to 100% effort. Okay, that is my spiel on the 50% effort. Uh, taking ownership. I encourage you to take ownership of, of course, your results. We're here to coach you, but you do have to follow through. But also, just, you know, take ownership of the, the facility. And when you're in, you know, it's uh, um, simple things, just no silly things like like dropping weights and uh, letting things slam into the wall and stuff like that. Let's just treat it like it's your second home, okay? Um, we all are in this together, so let's uh, take good care of our gym as well. I appreciate that. And all I ask for you for you to do is to follow through on your job, which is consistency, making it in, all right? We want to aim for three times per week or more. More is better, but three is fantastic. If you're getting three, you're doing your job. Uh, what we need to do is put it on your schedule. Develop a routine so that each week you know this day, this day, and this day, or maybe it's four days or five days, I'm, co I'm going in and it's at this time. Decide ahead of time and then don't let anything get in your way. This is your numero uno priority. All right. You also, oh, a great analogy for this one is thinking about it like shower, uh, showering. The way you uh, stay clean or the way you get clean is you stay clean, right? You keep showering. It's not like I get to shower for a week and then I'm good for the rest of the month. Same way with exercise. You know, just work out for a week and then you're good to take three weeks off. It's a continual thing. You want to make it a part of your normal day. All right. So this quote right here, success doesn't come from what you do occasionally, but what you do consistently. So let's really be focused on making it a consistent part of your day. This right here is an example of uh, the, the workouts getting started. You'll see everyone eyes are on the coach and gathering around the outside of the room as uh, we're about to get it going. And notice nobody's chattering with the, their neighbors. They're on time, ready to go. I, I'm baffled by the hands on the hips. That's a total coincident, coincidental thing. But anyways, it's cool. Uh, moving on, always working out at your level, not your neighbors. It's important that you aren't trying to compete with anybody or keep up with anybody. It's not about that. It's about finding your level and just working right there and then building up slowly over time. Here is a video that uh, uh, demonstrates this very well. All right, well, my video is not playing. So I guess we'll carry on. But you'll see on the Right, there's Shelly uh, hanging out here with uh, the step. She's going to do burpees where her hands hit the step. And Mike is going to do burpees with his hands holding on to a medicine ball the whole time. So I'm just going to, obviously I'm having some technical difficulties. I'm just going to skip past it. Uh, here, the only bad workout is the one that you didn't do. So you're guaranteed to have days that you're just not feeling it. You're not exactly up to going to work out. You think... I don't have everything to give, so I might as well not go at all. Well, totally the furthest thing from the truth. Everybody has off days. Go in, just stick to your commitment, and then knock out a half a workout. It's way better than no workout at all, okay? Come in, give it 50, 75%, and let's get it done. Now, let's be clear about what the reality is here and how this all works. The expectation usually is I can work out for a few weeks, and I'm going to look like this lady right here like an absolute machine. But in reality, we know this is a journey. You know it's not going to happen all at once. To get to the top of this hill on the right and to have that beautiful view, you're going to have to take several steps and it's going to happen over time. So be prepared for the journey. It's not going to be easy, but absolutely worth it. I promise you. Be patient. Ride it out. Let's do this together. Speaking of together, we're going to teach you how to do this every single step. 
one step at a time, just like climbing that, that hill, get into that great view. You're just going to have to make it, make sure that you are coming consistently like we talked about. And when you're ready past those first two weeks, you're hundred percent effort. And then everything else that we suggest you do outside of those 30 minutes with us, it's up to you. Follow through. Let's make that nutrition happen the way we suggest you do. And of course, if you are struggling or need help or have any questions, we're always here for you. That's how our program works. And what else do you need to know? Again, quick reminder, being on time and attentive during the demo. Make sure you're wearing clean shoes. Bring some water. Uh, if you don't, we do have water for purchase. Uh, always do your best, not anyone else's. And then, of course, encouraging your neighbors and the people around you. You know, that's how we all have a great experience as well. But then staying positive. Notice on the left, good vibes only. Uh, we really want to make sure that we foster a wonderful culture here. One that, uh, you know, never you never wonder what you're going to come into. You always know that it's going to be a great place to be. And always be grateful for the fact that you can exercise. There's a glass half full way to look at it. Uh, because there are many people in situations much worse off. So let's stay grateful for what we do have. And let's smile and have some fun. Cool. So our core values, our mission, our vision. We talked about this already, but don't forget. We're aiming to deliver outstanding results and help you live a higher quality of life. We do this with through building the community and positivity, gratitude. We want you guys to encourage. And of course, let's have Focus on our exercise, our nutrition, and our mindset, and let's spread it. I hope that we can impact the community in a huge way. All right, last but not least, if you haven't been in yet, this is what you can expect next. Come on in a couple minutes early to your first workout. Usually we set up an appointment for this, and then we'll give you a little tour. We'll also take a picture so that we've got your photo on uh, your profile uh, on our computer software, and then lastly, your payment. If you haven't already done uh, and take care, taking care of your payment, we'll just knock that out real quick as well. So uh, that's pretty much it. I hope that uh, I've answered a lot of questions for you. If not, you can reach out to us anytime. Uh, just give us a phone call, send us a text message, or hit us up on Facebook. All right. Thank you for your time, and we'll look forward to seeing you later.